coming spikes. right at you. It's got one headlight. Oh, He's boy. doing about 80. Swerving in my oh, lane. Boy. Look at... Good hit. Crashed out. Crashed out. Send the squad. That bit sound crazy. Fuck. Okay, so I want nobody else lost. I thought they crashed into somebody, but it's just them. Oh wait, somebody, somebody did else get hit. Somebody else did get hit. I don't know what I'm saying. Yep, it was a good job, ladies, gentlemen, kings, queens. How y'all doing? How y'all feeling today? We got here's why you shouldn't run from the police. Brought to us by Midway Safety. You know what I'm saying? Let's get smooth to it. Damn. What you oh. just witnessed was a crash at extreme speeds. Unfortunately, for one occupant, it proved deadly. Oh, what follows man. next is never before seen footage acquired by our dedicated team of volunteers. Graphic imagery is excluded from this video. On December 3, 2021, officers from both the Solon and Bentleyville Police Department in Ohio found themselves involved in a deadly chase. The suspect and his accomplice in the passenger seat were discovered after police officers randomly scanned their license plate and found the vehicle was reported stolen. Police reportedly followed the suspects until they pulled into a group home driveway. According to court documents, this Bentleyville patrol officer quickly lost track of the stolen vehicle after they exceeded 80 miles per hour Damn. in a 35 mile an hour zone. The Bentleyville officer then radioed neighboring departments about the situation in hopes of capturing the suspects. Solon officers responded responded, quickly assembling stop sticks down the road. Reacting quickly, officers attempted to reduce traffic in the area. I'm gonna stage in the intersection and block it off. That way, uh, we don't have a crash here. Putting other people at risk, fucking. I think it's in the stolen V, like. Oh shit, is this where? Damn, damn it's coming spikes. right at you, it's got one headlight, oh, he's boy. doing about 80. Swerving in my lane. Oh, boy. Look at. Good hit, crashed out, crashed out, send the squad. That bit sound crazy. Ooh, fuck. Okay, so I want nobody else lost. I thought they crashed into somebody, but it's just them. Oh wait, somebody, somebody did else get hit. Somebody else did get hit. I don't know what I'm just saying. Oh my Back god, here. that truck. Off, 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 off. Some officers go to the suspect's car, while others help injured civilians in the crash. The impacted pickup truck housed an 89-year-old ah. driver and his 85-year-old wife. Shit, man. Stand by for me. Hold on. Oh, man, I got hot. I'm on blood thinners. Okay. Shit. Radio got an elderly male on blood thinners. Elderly female with an engine. You're gonna fucking get bit! Oh, 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 Is she okay over there? Oh, Is she? Can we talk about it? Right! Can you check out that wipe on the other side? Man, switch to that nigga bot again. Can you get a uh, cover on him so I can put him up? Let's go. Let's go. Hang tight, I got people coming, okay? Can we talk to the hurt? damn wife, bro? Oh, or just shook up. Yeah. Okay, stay in the car for me, please. <laughs> yeah. Hold on. I'm standing. 
Oh, they're both fine, so it must be Don't the move. nigga's wife, bro. Can't move. Can't move. Can't move. She is. Okay. Are you hurt anywhere or just bleeding? No, oh, no, yes. Okay. Just lean against the car for me so you don't get dizzy. Yeah, I'm okay. Okay. Yeah, make sure the elderly, hey, make keep sure they. Keep your hands where I can see them. Like I said, it is yeah, legs, bro. Keep them hands right Shit. there. Where's the gun at? Don't point, don't reach for it. Just tell us. So, don't look at it. Look out that way. Keep your hands right there. Lean them right down on that car if you have to, but you do not bring them inside that car. Dumb doing? shit for yeah. nothing. Cover him, cover him. What's cover the driver, cover the driver. I oh. never get it. Maybe you should just give up next time. I want to drive. Might as well. <laughs> because well, I don't want to drive now. Stop driving. Is there anybody else in this car but you two? You want to have him climb out? Nobody in the back? So his legs broke. Nigga ready to throw his man under the bus. Can you move that way? Yeah. Hold on a minute. Oh, We're gonna check him first. He's got worse injuries. Uh, I do. No, he do. I do. You're bleeding out your I face, man. Up, man. I am. My mouth. I can't step up. Keep your hands right here. I'm gonna help you get out as soon as they deal with him, okay? Just because we wanted to be in the fast. Here, if pull. you hop out, I'll get it. I'll keep cover. Now, let's see. They must have bounced. I'm gonna see if I can get him out. Cover him. There's a gun in the car, so keep your gun on him. Okay. He's cuffed, but I'm gonna try to help him out of the car because he asked if I could help him climb out. Do you think you can move if I help you crawl out? My leg. Damn. Look at my leg. Uh, oh, I, I can't. I can't shit. pull you out. I'm just gonna hurt you more. Oh, he I can't out. see shit. His legs but broken. Let the fire department come and cut this open. Okay. Just oh, breathe in this nice thing and is slow. Shit, all keep the way up. up here. Keep talking to me. His legs are all folded up. He can't get out. I thought so. Oh my gosh, yo. Fuck no. How's she doing? Yeah, I got him. Was he trying to avoid him? Two in here. They're both going to need cut out. The driver may need, may be able to get out, but his leg's broken. Did we get the gun out yet or no? No. No, we don't know where it's at. What's going on, man? Okay. <laughs> Joe, come on over here. She's got a better line of fire. Keep an eye on both of them. I just hope the other people aren't too bad. I think these guys are probably going to be all right. He's still breathing okay? Talk to me, man. Okay. I know. They're going to take the top off the car probably and cut you out. No, no. They, they, they got to they do their thing, man. They got to fire up the jaws of life and cut you out. Can I get the glass on my arm? Go ahead. Got his ID? Uh, yeah. Did you get the wife's? No. Yeah, she's, Sally. Oh, uh, yeah, she's pretty banged up. Your wife's name's Sally? Oh, Sally, yeah. Uh, According to Adam, she's not good enough to answer any questions. Just off me. Drove right past me. Tell him, don't. I just kept that phone call. He's going to stay here. They're just one gun? So they say. If they could get the driver out, I could try to get the gun out. Yeah, I'm saying if the squad gets him out first. Driver might be able to get out. Or we just pull him out and sit him on the grass. Give me a damn pot. I'll take him out myself. There you go. My name's Dan. Here we're going to get some tools out. We're going to cut that door. We're going to spread it, okay? Did you see the other drivers? The other people from the other cars? BHD. See how bad they are? You doing okay? Don't need a squad to look at you right now? Uh, yeah, I'm okay. I'm just kind of shook enough. I don't think I'm injured. How you got hung up in this? I, I work right here. That's where I was going. You might have to take the day off. <laughs> the male, he's got a couple cuts. Um, he's okay. The female, she had some, uh, I guess, some stomach pain, some rib pain, possibly. Nothing life-threatening, though. It no, look no, like no, it. no, 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 no. They're lucky, and these guys are lucky. Despite the officer's positive outlook, things would go downhill quickly for one person yeah, involved yeah. in the crash. Hey, right, right like pocket, it. removing gun. Okay, go ahead. Who is it, bro? Stop with the. Let me pause for two seconds, cause I just... it's the it's the what is the suspense? There we go. Who, bro? Who? Is that the only gun on you? Is it, bro? Answer me, bro, before I let fucking off in this motherfucker. Where's the other gun at? Not another gun. Guarantee you, the press is gonna be all over it. Yeah. Dumbass. Come on, let's go. Oh, fuck. Not on the job, bro. Not on cam. Damn, bro. Come on, y'all. 
Shortly after the passenger is taken away from the vehicle, officers begin searching the decimated blue Ford for evidence. Is there any weed in there? Interesting. Hey, Jamie. Niggas, bro. That might be interesting. Hold everything because they shot a guy during the process. I don't know the condition of what the guy. All right. Are y'all? Somebody was shot when the car was taken. I'm gonna guess because that's why they were running. That that mask might have been used. Of course. You guys are. After some investigation, oh, officers true. discover the suspects were responsible for what courts would determine was a crime spree. Five days prior to the events shown in this video, the suspects committed crimes that resulted in roughly four dozen charges between the two of them. This included multiple counts of grand theft auto, aggravated robbery, aggravated theft, abduction, yeah. attempted murder, and felonious assault. The 19-year-old driver of the vehicle was already going through the court system for a separate incident that happened okay. roughly six months prior, where he faced 10 different charges related to drug trafficking and possession. According to news sources and court documents, the suspect was allegedly caught trafficking fentanyl-related drugs after oh, he rushed burnt. a friend to the hospital who was suffering from a gunshot wound. This case legally disallowed him from possessing firearms, a factor Dumbass. that would rack oh, up his sentence gunzo. for future incidents. Suspects obtained the blue Ford after they robbed and shot the owner, a 23-year-old working a second job as a Grubhub driver. Interviews with the victim indicate the suspects shot him in the hip and abdomen area, even though he fully complied with all their demands. Luckily, after emergency surgery, he was able to walk a week later, although the bullets still remained in his hip. His GoFundMe page is still active and can be found in the description below. In yeah, court, the main good. suspect and no. driver of the vehicle, J. Marlon Except Romeo Hayes, me. would be tried for all of his mentioned offenses. Yeah. On December 15th, the court listed a $750,000 bond that was never posted. Of course he not. alone would face over 30 charges for his actions, and he pled guilty to nearly all of them, it's likely in hopes cuts. of a lighter sentence. However, the court say. applied the Reagan Tokes law to several of his offenses. The Reagan Tokes law refers to a case where a 21-year-old student who was abducted, raped, and murdered in 2017 by a man on parole. This relatively new law allows the court to extend sentences beyond what court guidelines recommend. If it is determined the defendant would be a danger to the public if released on parole, his defense attempted to avoid the application of this law, citing his mental health issues, general lack of education, a 72 IQ, absence of a father due to prison sentences, oh and that he allegedly gosh. pled guilty to the crimes here. during a police Some interrogation, point. where they they failed to read his Miranda rights. 
they cited that Hayes was remorseful, wished to utilize prison programs to further an education, and eventually reunite with his infant daughter. You got a kid. Yeah, we can't let him get away. Oh, no. Yeah, because they're going to be in the wind carjacking people before the day's out. Unfortunately for Hayes, he was sentenced to multiple years in prison for every multiple. single one of his oh, guilty okay, verdicts. Okay. His longest I, individual I mean, charge up. was for an aggravated robbery, oh which was 11 at... years plus 3 years firearm specification, totaling 14 <laughs> years. If all of his charges were ran concurrently, meaning he serves multiple <laughs> sentences simultaneously, that would have been his full term. However, he would instead serve his sentences consecutively, meaning one after the other. This resulted in a verdict of 71 and a half years in prison. What? Hayes's defense team argued against this verdict in court, saying Hayes has the potential the to do good. He the court Shut responded up. with, quote, I hope that is true. However, any good you do for a long time to come will be within the state prison. Oh At gosh, 20 years bro. old, even under the best circumstances, You're he'll have done. to serve 85% of his Ugh. sentence under Ohio law and won't be eligible for release until he is 80. According to news sources, Shit. his accomplice Rontel Dante Parks was sentenced to 18 years in prison for his crimes. Even more lawsuits continued to rise from the events in this video. Damn. According to news reports, the then 89-year-old driver of the pickup truck is suing the officers involved in the chase. Although his 85-year-old wife was rushed to the hospital, she ultimately oh succumbed to her gosh, injuries just hours man. after the crash. In the wrongful death lawsuit, he claims their continuation of the chase, their use of stop sticks, their disregard for being in a residential area as school was being let out, and failure to evacuate citizens from the area caused the crash that killed his wife, whom he was married to for 65 That's fair. years. I ain't gonna lie. It's not clear if the woman's it's, health conditions both, played both a role. Ends. The image here indicates the pickup safety cage held up well under the forces of the crash, and there is seemingly no damage to the passenger side door. He is seeking combined damages of between twenty-five to one hundred twenty-five thousand dollars. That, that court case is still That's active, with a there? trial by jury currently scheduled on June third, twenty twenty-four. Lost because control. of the spike strips. Yeah, it was because he was control. going too fast, and the road was a little bit wet. And, and they're trying to blame him, Vic, yeah. blame victims. Because I was going through the intersection. This guy in this truck. Make eye contact with him. To stop. Oh, niggas lack accountability. See, now that's the shit I'll be talking about. Story. Okay. Since finalizing this video, we do have three updates. Talk the first is court records indicate there were a total of 52 charges filed on those two suspects over a six-month period. They're done. Many related Fuck to two. violent Here's crimes or gun violence. Two, the suspects are not going to be sued because there's simply no money there. Number say. three, you might hear stories about how fatal pursuits are on the increase. And fatalities did increase in 2021 as crime peaked. But fatal pursuits are now on the decline as violent crime is declining in most metros across America. Yeah. Finally, a big thank you to our small team of volunteers. They methodically tracked all these cases through the court system. Hey, we got video you, from multiple agencies and did the investigative I'll reporting to track I'm, down I'm, just I'm, about I'm, every I'm detail in this case. Please consider becoming a member to support our efforts. Thanks. Hey, man. Shout out to y'all. Great work. Hey. Great journalism, man. Um, hey, not gonna lie, it's a very, very tough situation. You got everybody at fault. You got the jackasses robbing and stealing and then speed, speed racing, speed chasing. The cops with no ca accountability. Like, okay, granted, you know what I'm saying? You said, y'all try to get their attention and make sure they stop, but. I ain't gonna lie, once y'all setting up shop to do something, y'all gotta make sure there's no way. Anybody's putting in in no predicament, you know what I'm saying? So I'd hey y'all at fault too. Um, I I wouldn't say that elderly is at fault. I really wouldn't, cause come on, bro. You're like I don't know, I don't know, bro. Anyways, man, tough situation. Links in the description, getting to them. Appreciate y'all for tuning in. You know what I'm saying? Links. Hey man, y'all take it easy. Good bit, 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 bit. Good bit.